Hello everyone, and today I will be showing you how to install a mod for League of Legends this time. Um, this mod will enhance your game's quality by changing the shaders and everything, so um, let's get started. I already tried it out and it looks pretty cool, if I can say so myself, um, and you should get it. I mean, if you're watching this video, you probably want to get it, so. So, I'll put this link in the description. Um, it's in this website called solaris.de, uh, Germany. But let's um, just scroll down when you're at this website until you see a button saying download, and then you click this thing here. All right, um, and then you just click download sta uh, Staten, yeah, that, and it'll download this zip file for you. Then we'll just go to uh, well, I guess we can just open that here. And just make a new folder on my desktop called shaders or something like that. Um, uh, okay, that's good. Just extract it somewhere else and then just open the folder. And then you're going to want to double click the lol slash HD application. If you are using an AMD card, it will give you this message, but I have an AMD card myself and I use this and it didn't give me any lag or performance drop whatsoever so only if you have a a bad graphics card I recommend you don't do this um, I mean yeah okay just click OK we'll bring this up and it'll you'll have to select the path from League of Legends and in my case it's in my C drive and then I think it is in my right games and then just click League of Legends so it's C drive and then write games League of Legends. If you chose another path you're gonna have to go find it like in program files or something like that. But normally it's there. So just click OK. And then it's set. Click OK again. And that'll give you this menu. So this is where you select the preset. There are various presets. The one I like to use because it's the one that looks best is um, the Bloom Plus High Contrast by 13 Blade 619, whatever. Um, yeah, just uh, I'm just gonna select that as an example, and then if you want to use it, just click Apply Preset. It will enable whatever this thing is here, <laughs> and and then the mod will be enabled too. And then you can just uh, click here if you want to disable it, uh, or you can go over here and select others, other presets, the one that fits you best if you like prefer lucky boys preset go ahead and choose lucky boys preset I'm not gonna stop you so yeah that's what you can do and that's pretty much it about this so I'm just gonna go in game and show you how it looks like um, I'll try to give you a comparison between how it is without the mod and how it is with the mod so you can get an impression yourself before you get it so yeah okay um, see you in game guys Okay, we're in game now, and as you can see, um, I've edited the video so you can get a comparison on both sides. And this is the one with the mod right now, um, in the shop, buying an item. And as you can see, the quality is a lot better. I like, um, you can see it immediately like when it switches. Uh, I even zoomed in so you can see the character a bit better. And now, look, like the moment it switched, you can see the detail is a lot less and now with the bloom and the shaders and the better shaders and the quality it's just like better overall and I'm just I just recorded a bit of a gameplay uh, of me playing around as Gaiden <laughs> uh, so that's pretty much what's gonna happen the rest of the video it's just gonna be me like uh, walking a bit and I got, I got one kill huh I got one kill <laughs> and you see that and it'll just keep switching so you can see the difference between uh, one the mod and no mod and I and I really recommend you get this mod it's really awesome it's really worth it okay um, I'll just leave you with the video uh, maybe I'll just put some music on and so you don't listen to nothing and thank you for watching guys don't forget to rate comment subscribe and see you next time